It's weird to think that within the course of a few weeks, this virus has changed from a distant issue to something that now keeps us locked inside. It's seen online classes become the norm for the next four weeks. The Tihui boys both graphed for eight weeks, then despair at it now being over. And a whole lot of fear engulf our community and nation. People often ask what kinds of people we will be when our backs are up against the wall. They often wonder whether in times of strife we will make noise or we will go into our shells. A school of nearly 800 people has never seemed more quiet. Yet the urge to say something has never been stronger. During this period of isolation, everyone will go through their own battles. Everyone will face their own demons. But whether we let the demons stay with us or let it be a, a mere cameo, it solely depends on us. No one should ever try and convince you that offering someone a smile is not important. No one should ever tell you that in times like this, it is better to remain sombre and quiet. At school, we are a community that always seems to be close-knit, whether that be in the house, in class, or on the sports field. We're close-knit because we don't let our voices die out, our smiles go upside down, and our passions diminish. This should not change because we now are literally standing side by side. Because at the end of the day, this is when standing side by side seems to be the most important thing we can do. With the YouTube channel, Soul Food, and Facebook pages in a school sense ever based to keep on smiling. In the prefect body alone, you have 27 ordinary people like you, all willing to hear your experiences, all willing to laugh with you, cry with you, and support you during these confusing times. No one said that this was going to be easy. But for a school that punches above our weight, in the centre of a nation that does the same, it's only right we give this a good go. Because for the next four weeks you have a guarantee of 800 fans. 800 people who are with you every single moment of every single day, all building up to when we can next see each other face to face. If us prefects barely singing we are the world, or the staff shouting always look on the bright side of life tells you anything, it should be that we are willing to step out of our comfort zone. Because in the end, whether you like it or not, you will be put out of your comfort zone. The question is, will you approach it with fear or head on? Indeed, looking at the brighter side of life. Will you try and tackle this issue alone or use the resources you have been given? There are 800 people within this school. Each with a different story. Yet, each within this exact moment. Only wanting one thing. Solidarity. To all the parents watching this, we wish you good luck. As for the next few weeks, you will be helping us all, all while navigating yourself through this for the very first time. To the staff, we wish you good luck as you try and teach via FaceTime around 20 students each period, each weekday, all while managing your family back at home. And finally, to the students, good luck. As like us, you sit strapped to your seat, slowly making your way to the top of the roller coaster, unsure of the slope that awaits at the end. Just remember, the roller coaster doesn't just carry one person, it carries all of us. And every so often, try to join in with the screams of your peers as you make your way around the many loops and turns. We normally ask you to see what makes you different from everyone else. Now we ask you to join back in with the crowd. So stay strong, stay positive, continue to ask for help, Remember, we're all in this ride with you. It is this time alone that ironically, we need you the most. So from all of us prefects, we wish you all the best during these next four weeks. And we can't wait to see you all on the other side of this journey. So kia kaha New Zealand, and stand firm in the faith.